Right, so getting started, we'll go to Start Computer and we'll go into the R drive. We'll go into Computing and we're going to copy and paste this folder to your Z drive in My Documents and rename it. So you right click and copy it. We go into, make sure you are in Z drive, then My Documents and hopefully you have a computing folder. We'll right click and paste into here and then in that folder we're going to rename this as My First Web Page. We'll double click on this and you'll see there's an HTML file there. I want you to right click that and edit with Notepad++. Now what we'll see first of all is that there might not be a lot in here so you might only have um, HTML head, title head. So the first thing is we'll title our web page. Um, so let's call it James Smith's first web page. Save it. And if we run and launch this in Chrome, we won't see much, but actually we'll see that in the tab at the top it says James Smith's first web page. If we go back into Notepad Plus Plus then um, we're going to now add a heading. So you'll notice on mine it was uh, my favourite nursery rhymes. You might either choose my favourite books or my favourite films. So let's say you choose um, my favourite books. And the first book title you're actually going to put in here. So let's say for example if Hunger Games was your favourite book, we would then need to put in the website address here. So in Chrome, let's just go to Hunger Games, and it's going to be the book, so you might want to just take um, the Wikipedia page. You could also take um, a page from Goodreads if you wanted to, but let's just copy this website address, and in Notepad++ we're going to paste that in here. Let's just do that again. Right click, copy, and we'll paste that in there. Yeah. Um, if we save this, run and launch this in Chrome now, you'll see that we have your main title, you have your main heading, you have another heading which says Hunger Games. When you click on that, it goes to um, the Hunger Page, Hunger Games Wikipedia page. Um, after that, we'll need to add some text describing um, why this is your favourite book and then we can go on to adding images.